Derek Pierce announced he is stepping away from his position as principal of Casco Bay High School, a school he founded back in 2005. Schooling is about not just creating educated people, though that's absolutely important. It's about creating splendid humans, um, people who are committed to bettering our world. The school has grown from about 80 students to over 300 students, maintaining a 98% college acceptance rate. Casco Bay High School gives students the opportunity to learn public speaking and focus on a need in the world they are passionate about. All students have to take a stand on a public policy issue and then um, present and defend their research to a panel of experts, um, including proposing the legislation that they think is necessary to move their issue forward. Senior projects include topics like social media addiction, the lack of affordable housing, and child abuse and neglect in the U.S. Critical thinking skills that are encouraged by faculty and staff under Pierce's leadership. They come to us as ninth graders, and you know, maybe one out of ten kids are really confident in leading in a classic way, but most just young people, and they, they're confused, um, and they learn that their voice will actually matter. It's um, challenging kids to do things they didn't think they could do, stuff that's hard and meaningful, meaningful to them, meaningful to the world, um, so that they're constantly having to expand their boundaries of what they thought they could do, and in the process of that challenge, they learn who they are. Gashim Napier, who is a former student at Casco Bay High School, is now a teacher hired by Principal Pierce. Coming back was truly because of Pierce, but also um, to like he believed in me. A new principal has not been selected to replace Pierce. Pierce has been a part of ongoing discussions on the idea of consolidating all of the Portland high schools. He says it is a 10-year process. I hope that Casco Bay continues to evolve and grow. Reporting in Portland, I'm Talia Clark for Maine's Total Coverage.